everyone welcome to back my youtube channel thank you so much to like my old uh, videos and now i will give you please like and subscribe my uh, channel and share it with your colleagues friends and uh, okay so today uh, we will discuss about uh, to how to get the internet status like the online and offline status in your uh, angular application okay so today let me give you very context okay this is the uh, my simple angular setup okay here this was my angular setup okay so here very simple uh, code was written the internet status and this is my uh, the tsx file this is the js file and what are this all are the required uh, where do we go yeah here so these are the my uh, required component which was uh, uh, written by here okay so today we will discuss about uh, to get the, how to get uh, the uh, current status of the internet like if you are uh, using any creating any angular application uh, for the online and offline status as an example okay so if you uh, want to be uh, use a if your internet is not working then you can get a some status and based on your status you will uh, identify your application in the process okay so this is uh previously i was written a very uh one article related to this so there is the same which was written in the crowd crowd pro gigs okay where i will explain uh, like how to get uh, the same online offline status okay here i was explain uh, this is the simple javascript code then uh, this is the html code uh, for the app components file and this is the t uh, type type script code here and then this is the simple uh, css was written and here is my uh, demo on the github url okay so let me uh, go with this this is my um, let me first i will uh, give you the context of uh, the tsx file so i just copy this tsx file here okay here i just uh, map the rsx js operator uh, using the map and then internet status which was written and then uh, call a check internet status in ng on it function in the same function i was use only the simple some term and condition like this way and get a uh, status the same status was uh, passed to the internet status code okay now let me pass this one uh, my html code here so let me copy this html okay and so now we will check like what how is this was so now this will see the, the uh, this was coming okay so let me there is a one uh, concept here so this was here okay so this this is the online and this is the offline status okay okay now if you see this is the online right now okay so let me just uh, summarize some css here also so i just uh, pasted this CSS. so i just written uh, two type of uh, css here one for the online and second for the offline okay so this is right now the online status okay so if you are a uh, if you want to be uh, go with offline status so let me go the offline now so if you see this is what's coming offline now so let me come back again and do a internet yeah okay so in a couple of seconds you will get a status now you see without any refresh and everything you will get a again uh, the status of your application okay so uh, without refreshing this page you will get a status again uh, let me give you okay again i will okay see this was again offline now i will do that again see so according to your uh, internet bandwidth and everything this will take some uh, millisecond or second time to get the status okay this was okay now see uh, this is the basic uh, overall of this uh, status here we will just simply return three type of code here one was only for the css this was and then we just uh, map uh, the rsx operator here and uh, call it uh, the internet status here then and this was just a html code which was written okay so using with this code you will get a very uh, quick uh, status in your application in angular just for the internet uh, functionality like this was uh, the online and the offline okay so this was the same code was uh, pushed in my github uh, repository here this is my in the github ui uh, profile this was uh, glockish94 and this was my name is lockish Gupta. please uh, follow my uh, github also and here is my uh, the, the same code was uh, pushed in this repository 
then this is my uh, edited well code for the stack builds also and here is this is why my the latest uh, demo so let me push this the same code in the intern uh, github then same will be uh, generating here let me go back it's just a push the code here okay this was pushed okay here is the code was written okay and then we will come here okay now see this was uh, my the demo ui here we will get the current status also let me do this here also okay. this okay that's it from my side thank you so much to watching this video if you want any more video related to angular please comment uh, your suggestions and your questions in the same uh, video comment thank you so much